I wanted to say about Ames Institute that our medicine is soul-based. And I like that idea, but I didn't, we decided not to because we don't know what the soul is. You know, it's, it's arrogant. Like, that's like the big search, you know, big mind-body problem that's intrigued me my whole life is, like, well, do we really have a soul? And what happens after we die? And what is it? And, and uh, but, but that concept is <laughs> really the most important thing about a person who comes to any healer is their psyche their mind, how they feel, their fear, their, their pain, their suffering. And it's, it's all, as Deepak Chopra would say, it's all qualia, it's all experience, right? And people come in with, and we see really sick people and with terrible psychological and physical wounds and traumatized from chemotherapy and scared. And, and so the medicine we provide is mind and body. It has to be both, and so we talk a lot about one spiritual orientation. And every time I see a patient, I ask, I ask two questions: like, why do you think you got this now in this part of your body? And then two, do you have any kind of a spiritual orientation? Oh, three questions. And then the third thing is, what's the purpose of your life? And because. If you don't have a purpose to your life, then why are we so busy keeping you alive a few days longer, you know?